morning everybody I forgot what I was gonna do this video about so I'll just do whatever comes into my mind next hmm okay now there's still Michael Jackson drama just like when James Brown died there's James Brown drama uh, David Carradine drama so on and so forth um, I'm not going to touch that. So that's all the Michael Jackson I'm going to do today. Um, like I said, my computers are taking craps on me. The laptop, the DVD-ROM or Blu-ray, whatever the hell this is, this thing is not working anymore. Um, so then I can use my external hard drive to do a bunch of stuff, but then, you know, uh, on my network I have to... I gotta burn the DVD or something. I have to go put it in my computer, finish mixing it down, what have you. Go outside to my other computer on the other side of the house, uh, hop on the network and burn it off the network. So I can still burn everybody's DVDs. I promise them. So I'm gonna start mailing out in a couple of days and so get some more money. Um, what else? Oh yeah. Shit, I can't talk about that. Hmm. Oh, my court case, of course. I told you, uh, going to jury trial, they keep on putting it off. Um, they said there's not going to be any more settlement conferences. But then, of course, there's another settlement conference they just added just recently to see if I'll throw myself under the bus, which is riding pretty fast and coming pretty close. Now, um, hmm, what else I got to say here? Hmm. Well, of course, they they don't want the auto companies doing stuff. That somebody just told me something about that. So, who cares? They're gonna do what they want to do anyway with that. Whoever they are, they're going to do what they want. Um, hmm. I don't know. This is pretty boring today. Um, I haven't started watching videos on YouTube, so um, that's uh, another reason why I really don't have anything to say. Like uh, I tried to comment on a wise Nubian video, and. Uh, it wouldn't let me go through. I commented on the sexy sci-fi video, aka London Canada, and um, the video got some pretty good response because people could understand what I'm talking about. Um, London was pretty much saying that Obama is not addressing uh, certain situations that go down in America. Um, the black issues. Obama is staying away from black issues. Um, he is. Okay, so, um, like I was saying, um, the worst thing can happen is a black president try to fix something that white leaders have created in the past. It just wouldn't look right, it wouldn't feel right, and it wouldn't be right. Um, that's one topic that I don't think will go away anytime soon. Um, the political situation, blah, blah, blah. Uh, war, yakety yakety, smackety yakety. Who gives a fuck about? I don't care about these wars. I'm just burned out with them. That's one thing about America. They teach us how to be burned out and say fuck it. We don't have the overall stamina to keep and fight. We don't. We don't. We don't fight to the end. We just don't. Nothing. Um. Anybody out there got Sony Vegas? Um. Sony Vegas. Seven? If you do, <laughs> I know this is highly illegal. I need a damn serial number. I really do. I lost my serial number, and I've been looking for key codes and, you know, key, you know, what's the damn word, uh, key uh, generators and everything so I can fire up my Sony Vegas, and I can't find one. Uh, I, need, I need a serial number. Bad. I need, man, it was four in the morning. Please, man, just give me one serial number, please. It's a joke. It's a drug joke. It's not actually four in the morning. It's actually 7.53, and I'm pretending like a drug addict to get just one. Just, just give me one serial number. It's a joke. People don't see it like that. They'll skip through the video, see me shaking and shit. I told you it's crazy. Another thing I've been thinking. 
every time we do these videos, sometimes we be having the craziest facial expressions. And you know it. When you watch some of these videos, people be like, toe up looking all up in the face, you know, just looking all crazy and stuff. What happens when we die? And then the word gets around on YouTube, such and such is dead. Or just say we killed or anything stupid. Can you imagine how they're going to look at me and my departure? What do you think they're going to say about me? First of all, they're going to say I was crazy and only showed clips when my eyes is bugging out and I'm doing something stupid. Or they say I was a lunatic, only show me spouting racial stuff. Or they will say um, something else negative and only show certain things. Notice and watch what you say and how you say things on YouTube because they can and will be used against you in the court of law. And one more thing I want to say for all of us who get in here in the camera and looking from left to right and talking and, and everything and then we say something about the government that can be misconstrued facial recognition okay why well, you think they got all these people in America getting on these web shows web shows web uh, uh, on the internet talking facial recognition that way they got us in a computer in a database I'm pretty sure I gave them enough side views and looks. They can pretty much make a plastic mask out of me right now, run and go do something, and I'll be sitting up in court talking. It wasn't me, and they, we got video, and like, I'm like, this wasn't me in the video. You know how we all look alike? And be like, you know what? That's your ass. When you hold your hands up like that, shit, they might even have our fingerprints too. I don't know. Plus, they fingerprinted us as a baby. They started that way back in the day. Did you know that? Did you know that every single person born from a certain time to now has all been fingerprinted, period, at birth. And they take some of your blood, too. But people don't know about that. And they've been doing it since way back in the day. Taking a vial of your blood. Put your name on it. Dracula style. Oh! Now that I heated the video up, went crazy and everything, now I'm back. So listen. Everybody out there doing your thing, just remember, be kind and respectful to somebody else, and hopefully that comes back. That's another thing you need to worry about, respecting other people. I know sometimes times get hard, and people look stupid and do dumb stuff. Let that shit pass. Pretend like you don't even see their asses. Like, there goes Jimmy again. Not funny. I've been telling people lately, when they're funny, you know, people walk up and, sponta and do spontaneous comedy and shit. You know, people do that. They walk up, hey! You know, and when you know the person, they're going to be trying all their whole comedy routine out on you every time. Don't hesitate to tell somebody when it's not funny. Period. Okay? I'd appreciate that. And one more thing. And for all those gay people that watch me, Please do not take this in the wrong way, but I am so tired of seeing homosexuality in movies, period. Every blockbuster movie, I, I didn't really catch none in uh, The Terminator, and not The Terminator. I didn't really catch any in uh, Transformers, but I really wasn't looking that hard in Transformers either. Um, of course, Land of the Lost. Homosexual shit in it. Um, what else? Uh, the Hangover. That was in there too. I am tired of seeing Hollywood blatant homosexuality. And it doesn't matter if there are gay people out there. We need to stop portraying straight men as gay every chance you get. Tropic Thunder was the worst for me. I'm trying to watch this movie and it's good and it's funny. And then there's Jack Black talking about giving oral sex. And it wasn't funny. In the land of the lost, it wasn't funny. I'm just tired of seeing blatant homosexual jokes in movies. Because they're not funny. I know a lot of gay people that don't act blamey or none of that. And it's pitiful to see how they're portrayed in movies or even the homosexual uh, innuendo in films. You've been tubed.